Dean, your thoughts on that game today? Um, look, big moments in the game. Um, I'm really disappointed with the three goals we conceded. They were off and restarts. Um, I thought we had good opportunities to sort of retake the lead at 2-2. Their lads cleared a great one off the line. Uh, they've headed one sort of off the line as well. And um, with a good chance at the back post with Addy. And uh, their second goal is obviously frustrating because it's a clear goal kick and he gives a corner and they score from that. So, look, in a tense game, in a derby, the way it is, you need a little, little bit of luck. And I think the luck was on their side today. Obviously, doing really well this season overall. Last few results probably not gone the way that we'd have hoped. Uh, what do you think that's down to? I've seen too many goals, too many silly goals. Um, so yeah, look, there's some naive goals in the last two weeks have been a disaster really. So we've got to really lick our wounds. We've got to stick together and we've got to move on. We've got a nice break now with the FA Cup next week. So we get a break away from the, the league campaign. So hopefully we can um, we can get ourselves in the next round of the FA Cup. But So I just think the main thing we just got to do is stay calm. I know what I want to do with the side. I know what I want the team to go. And uh, we've just got to fix these uh, these issues we're having at the minute. Obviously, you just touched on there. Next game is the FA Cup game. Is that a welcome distraction? Do you think? I think we need it now. Obviously, after the way the last two weeks have gone, um, we've conceded way too many goals. As simple as that. Teams that can see goals they just don't have success. So, for some reason, it's just crept into our game. Um, it happened at Chesterfield. Obviously, we conceded four the night as well, and we conceded three tonight, which is really disappointing. So. Um, look, the main thing is is that um, that's how quick football can change. Um, and I'm always a big believer in keeping your guard up. And the main thing now is we stick together and, uh, and just move on to the next game. So it's, uh, we do have to uh, sort, of sort out the issues we've got at the minute. Obviously, overall, it's been a really positive season so far. There's obviously, you mentioned that the main issue is conceding goals. Is that just something that needs to be sorted on the training pitch? Or do you think there need to be additional players? Or what do you think needs to be done? Well, I think as some, apart from Gateshead last week, who to be fair they beat us and beat as well. I think the other games have been much much tighter. Obviously, the scoreline suggests today. Um, Crete was a tight game. They scored late in injury time. Like I say, I'm a bit aggrieved about the decision the referee made, but at the end of the day we all make mistakes um, for the second goal. And we had enough chances. I thought we'd better chances today, clearer chances. I know they hit the crossbar late and scored late. We'd better chances, but I'm just really disappointed to see corners. Um, the main thing for us is to. Uh, is to just keep trying to improve every day. That's what we try to do. And this division's relentless. It's rootless. There's no easy games at all in the division. So um, we're still in a great position. There's a long, long, long way to go. Um, we've still got another five months, maybe six months of football. So let's just keep going one game at a time and see where it takes us. You mentioned about obviously the togetherness. We've had a really good year so far. I'm not sure on the numbers, but a lot of fans come out today. What's your message to them tonight? Yeah, I'm gutted for them. I'm, I know how much it means. Um, I'm gutted for them, to be honest with you. Uh, but look, we have to just lick our wounds. That's important because when you lose a game of football, you have to treat it the exact same way as you win a game of football. There's a way to win and there's a way to lose. And we'll be always humble in our approach as a football club. We're obviously extremely professional. And I thought our fans got behind us. Um, different stage of the game, we gave them things to sing about, but it just wasn't our day today. Dean, thank you for your time. Cheers.